Hey everybody, happy Wednesday. Um, I'm excited and um, I'm just waiting for the audience to start building and get the pages up that I'm going to share and train with you, train with you today. And um, let's see. I just wanted to say I'm so excited that everybody's here with me today. Let me get over to my website, kristenpaborski.com. And um, let's see, is anybody here yet? There you are, hey. Okay, thanks, I appreciate it. And if I'm looking away, it's just because I'm um, over here getting things set up on the blog for you. Um, while um, people are joining the call here, so let's um, let's get it um, let's give it a few more minutes, and I'm gonna sign in here because what I'm gonna teach you guys today is one of my favorite things. I'm here talking to you guys about how to 10x your traffic on your website. This is for people um, who are entrepreneurs. And small business owners, you have a website online, you're selling products and programs, and you have services you want to sell, and you need traffic to your website. And not some, like, just really hard, newfangled ways, blackout ways, stuff, simple things that you can do to get more traffic to your website and to get out in front of more people. So that's what I'm here to do. Every Wednesday, I'm on here and teaching uh, people how to do simple things that they can uh, implement themselves um, and uh, get, get more, more people on their website. Sorry, I'm just like trying to do two things at once. And um, let me just get on here and get this uh, pulled up for you because I'm gonna teach you guys today uh, how to embed a Facebook video like I'm doing here on your website and then to be able to promote it back out on uh, on your uh, social media and get more people watching your Facebook and over to your Facebook page so it's just another way of repurposing your content that you already have so um, let's just uh, hop over here on your website there's a place that you can go, so it's really, really easy. So I'm gonna take you through this. Um, one of the things I'm gonna start talking to you about before I take you right into that, there is a ton of things I wanna talk to you about repurposing your content so that you can go out and um, get more traffic from it. So what I suggest you do is to go through your blog posts and look for your most popular content. And if you are not doing that already, you need to know what are your top things that are uh, most popular on your website. You can go and look on Google Plus and see, Google Plus, I'm sorry to me to say that, on Google Analytics and see what your top content is. Or if you have a couple plugins on your website, uh, such as the Jetpack site stats, that's one of my favorite ones. I get obsessed with it, but it is really neat because you can see like the last seven days what's going on on your website. So if you have that plugin I, or you don't have it, I suggest you put that on there. Trust me, knowing what is your top content on your website is your key to more traffic, more people buying for you, and getting more people into your funnels, and knowing what kind of products and programs, if you don't already have them in your repertoire, what is going to um, really make you money. And I, I've done this many times. It, it doesn't matter if you are an online entrepreneur or you work in the retail world. You just give your clients what they want. I've built six-figure businesses for my clients just by applying this one simple tactic. And um, it, it, I know it works. So anyways, so back to repurposing your content. I've written this blog post and when I'm done with this live, I will put all the resources on there. But uh, the resource or this um, blog post, it's all about repurposing your content and uh, getting more traffic from it. So that's kind of what I'm doing today because I am doing a 
Facebook Live here. I'm teaching you one of the things that is so important to me is this repurposing your content. And then I'm just going to show you one little trick today how to take this video. Well, I'm going to actually take a video I did from last week and uh, get the code that I can just go copy and paste on my website and embed it into my blog. Isn't that cool? And then it's on your website forever and ever and you can keep promoting it out on social media, which you should be doing anyways, and getting more people to um, over to your website. I mean, that's the end goal. I know we want them to be watching us on Facebook and teaching and all of that. That's how you get people to know who you are. But anytime that you can drive more people over to your um, website, even better. Okay, so let me just go over to this post here because I actually have the... Um, code posted in, pasted in here. So let me just 1019. Yep. That's it. Okay. So let's go into quick into edit here. Okay. So let's flip this around and I'm going to show you really quick how to embed a Facebook live video on your on your blog and turn it into a blog post okay so let me just go into my Facebook and I will .com. go find myself over there pull up a video and show you how easy it is let's log in okay Kristen Pavorsky, let me tell you, super easy. And then you go to the, um, embed video, copy and paste. Okay, so let's go over here and I will pull up the video and then I will show you because I just, it was super easy. Well, let's just show you, see? WordPress on the back side. Let's make sure that this is pointing at the right place. There you can see my video. This is last week's video that I put here on my WordPress. And it was super easy. So all I did here was, and I'm just going to show you um, if you're in here. So let's go look at the text block. You'll see the embed code right there. The little iframe code. That's all I did was copy and paste that. So let's just go hop right on over to Facebook. We will find the video that we want to embed. We'll go to an old one here, okay? Let's just go over here. Let's see if we can. Hey, more settings. Oh, sorry. I did this just fine. There we go. So you want to go to this. So you go over here and then on the down thing, embed. See how easy it is? So let's just go back. So I show you one more time exactly what I did. I go over to my website over to my Facebook page, pick a video. Okay, so you see it looks like this right, right now, see? I'm gonna stop myself here. from talking because you don't even see. You can't embed it from here. So you have to touch, go to that up at the top, click on that. So you just see the video like this, then you grab this down key and you go right over to embed. And look what's really cool. You just copy and paste this right here, this code right there that pops up, and let me just go, shh. sorry, my, I'm having a little uh, command C. Okay, let's go back over. We'll just add some more, another text area, text block in here. And we'll go over here, you do it on the text side. So you go over here, here I am in the text blocks. Okay, I'm gonna 
Copy that in there. There's the embed code right in there. Okay, let's go back to the visual side. And there it is, embedded right inside your post, right? Super duper easy. So we will just preview this little post. You can see them both on there. Talk about easy. See, there it is. There's the video. This is last week's. Hey, everybody. How are you? Yeah, super easy. So if you aren't already doing your Facebook lives, I suggest you do that. And then what you do after that is you um, take that blog post and you promote it all out on social media by hand with your copy, put it everywhere. Um, people want to watch you on video. So what I suggest you do to get started is number one, go find out what is your most popular content out here on, uh, on your blog. You get on Facebook Live, you teach it to your audience, and then you take that video and you embed it back in over on your website. It's like the easiest thing to do. And um, next week, what I'm going to do is we're going to dive into more video. I'm going to show you a few more video repurposing um, techniques so that you can take your video or your blog post, put them out on YouTube and other places, okay? Because we're going to go through all of the ways that you can repurpose your content and get it out there in front of more people. And then we're going to dive into um, audio because that's important too because there's plenty of people out there who want to know, uh, want to repurpose their stuff into audio or even books. So we're going to, you know, find all these different ways that we can, um, I can help you get out in front of more people. So I'd love to hear from you. If you have any suggestions, um, any feedback that you want to give me, uh, um, anything you want me to teach, I would love to be able to help you out. I'm also going to put a link at the bottom of the video here when I actually post it over on Facebook for the replay. Uh, I have this great opt-in. It shows you exactly where to take your content once you put that video over there on Facebook, on your blog, what you do next with it. Um, all the different places that you can Put your content out there and reach more people because I'll bet there are a few places that we that you could be getting traffic from that you aren't even thinking about posting so I hope you found this helpful I hope you have a great Wednesday and I hope to see people posting their Facebook lives over on their blog and getting it out there to more people okay take care have a great day and I will be back next week with another tip